This is Divine Solar Empress 333, and I'm coming to do a reading for my Earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. And I am using my Isis Oracle deck. These are beautiful, and they're big, and they're just gorgeous. I rarely use them because the energy is just so fire, and I just, I, I just, I love this deck. It's just so beautiful. You know what? I ordered a bracelet because this is my um, obsidian and tiger's eye. But I ordered the bracelet with Lacillus Lapsilis Lazili, um, the temple of Lapsilis Lazili, um, the goddess of ancient skies. That blue, see that blue? It's it's also in this box too. That beautiful. It's this blue. Man, it's so beautiful. I mean, let me get one more to kind of cap this off earth signs because I turned it over and saw that and I just thought it was so beautiful and I ordered it the other day. I wanted a bracelet like that. It's so beautiful. I have crystals, little um, crystals for it too, but I think this is falling forward. It's the portal of light. She she glides on wings through time and space. And the power of the seven scorpions, the power to conjure lower vibrational forces. Ooh, let's look up some of this, what this is. portal of life. It is only this physical reality that is bound by time and space. You are being conscious on levels beyond the physical world. You are guided to work with your healing powers beyond the confines of time and space and allow your sense of self to expand. It is safe for you to do this now. You you will not become ungrounded through such spiritual growth. You are not leaving your earthly awareness. You are instead adding to it. Whoa. You are growing in power and awareness. You had a breakthrough insight where you realized that you are not who you thought you were. You are in fact much vast, vaster being so you are way bigger spiritually sometimes this would sometimes this was shocking and uncomfortable and difficult to accept oh i think i'm gonna do a reading on this one because this is powerful and i want to understand this more and i know if i do it through here it's gonna be like an hour reading herb signs what's up let me go to the power of the seven. Um, oh, the power of the seven scorpions. Um, <laughs> you are being initiated into the magic of conjuring to have the power to affect lower vibrational forces through your own will and spoken word. You are guided to use this powerful gift with compassion and discernment, with mercy and non-judgment. You can manage any toxicity in your life swiftly and with great effects. Oh, the Lady Isis teaches the art of conjuring, of being able to use will and word to gain dominance over lower vibrational energies. You must be careful using this gift with compassion, respect, and love. Using words with care and firmness will bring great healing into your life. I'm trying to tell you. It's crazy because um, I had a dream a while back. Um, this had to be maybe like six, seven months ago. It's a while ago. Um, where I was dreaming. Um, and it was like, I'm not going to play with y'all. It was like thriller. Like literally... I had like zombies around me and it was like I was controlling them 
You know what I mean? It it was like Michael. Like, you know how Michael made them dance in the video? But it was like I was controlling them. I wasn't scared or anything. It, it was like they were doing what I said. And I thought that was so powerful. And this is the first time I ever really kind of shared that. But this is kind of what is making me, it's making me think of that dream a little bit of that. Like being able to control, you know, that, that's, that's, man, that's all I can say. <laughs> so wherever you are, you're stepping into something new, a whole new power, and you'll be able to control stuff, not just on this physical plane, but definitely, um, ooh. Okay, emperor. I have an emperor here. This is some type of leadership. It could be a father figure um, as well. But definitely somebody who is of authority. And then I have the Eight of Wands. So you could be getting some type of communication maybe from this person. Something, com maybe, maybe they're making a quick decision or something. Um, this emperor or emperor, you could be um, getting some type of quick decision in your favor or, or something. But I have the hermit here. So it's some type of inner soul searching, like I said, um, you you could be getting, and, I, and my mind said download for some reason. You could even be getting some type of information or download um, once you kind of go within. It's like a whole new perspective of, um, and it could be coming to you quick, or you could be going towards um, this emperor with some type of information. Or there could be some type of investigation or something as well. Or it could even be with this hermit here. It could even be an ancestor um, that is kind of giving you some type of guidance. Or maybe even a download. You know what I mean? This could be a masculine um, ancestor as well with this hermit here. Um, that could be definitely giving you some type of info or something. Yeah, maybe even about a betrayal. Something that was done. Maybe even deception. I have the Seven of Swords. And you have a Queen of Wands. So this could even be your wife. With this fire energy as well. This could be a, a wife. Mm. But there's some type of conflict, or even competition. Some type of fighting. Five of Wands. Yeah. Two of Wands. So you could be leaving this person. Maybe you're getting some type of information about this person betraying you. Or, you know, something this person did to you. With this um, hermit here, it could have been even an investigation or something. Maybe even about fraud. You know what I mean? Maybe you're making a quick decision to, to get away from this person. Because some type of imprisonment here. Eight of Swords. It could be some type of restriction. Maybe you were thought you were bound to this person or you felt mentally isolated. It's something it's something to do with that. But you could be you could be protecting yourself, you know, kind of standing your ground to this person. Yeah, seven of wands. It's definitely something with the feminine energy. And you both are coming up as fire signs. Yes, I have the eight of cups. So you could have walked away from this person. You could have left this person behind. Or they could have left you. Even when you went to, I heard, when you went to prison. Maybe you even went to jail or prison. And this person left you or they did something to you, betrayed you. Uh, Page of Pentacles. So you may even be getting some type of news or info. me a few more okay Ooh. yeah it seemed like this person was kind of yeah there's some type of conflict you could have been in a abusive relationship with this uh, feminine energy or queen of wands you could have been in an abusive, abusive relationship with this emperor 
But I have the Eight of Pentacles. So somebody was definitely, definitely trying to master some type of conflict or betrayal or even being sneaky with this Five of Swords. But there's some type of deadlock or stalemate with this person or even some type of stalemate with even with a choice. Like I said, this person could have been working hard to even betray you. Mm. But there's a tower in judgment fell out too. So, whoa. Fire, fire. Like, this is fire energy. It could even be a fire. Whoa. This is fire energy and air and earth. A lot of fire out here and earth. Yeah. But, um, yeah. Maybe you, you call judgment on this relationship and it led to some type of tower. You had some type of awakening. But I feel like, Emperor, this is you calling judgment on this um, Queen of Wands. Because she came out in conflict with the Five of Wands and betrayal. <laughs> so it seems like maybe you've called judgment. There's a tower. Would you coming out with this hermit? I think you went in hermit mode. But it seems like maybe you're getting some type of download or some type of message. But you're, you're learning to control. Like you're going to be able to um, control something or dominate something. Lower lower vibrational energies. Like, hmm. with the fire sign reading it was a uh, masculine energy you could be a shoe lover divine masculine you could be a shoe lover this hmm. you could have took a trip overseas or this person took a trip overseas but there's something about three bodies being passed in a, an apartment and it says drunk driver crash on the way to hurt you so you could have had somebody trying to do something to you, Divine Master. Or this Divine Master could have done something to somebody. But somebody poisoned your food. And somebody could be spiritually spying, a hunter. Fake news again. Somebody could have gave you some fake information. They're saying the devil made them do it, which is fake. They knew what they were doing. They poisoned your food. Somebody could have poisoned you. And you could have not died. It says alive, not dead. And ancestors from the dark are helping you. I'm telling you. That's what it's meaning about the lower vibrational energy. Oh, you're being able to your ancestors. Like I said, that could have been, that emperor could have been, um, uh, uh, Something about a workplace affair, same sex. It says bed, bed and breakfast getaway. So somebody could have went overseas, maybe to a bed and breakfast getaway with somebody, or they went somewhere. It's some type of work affair. It's same sex though, and a risk taker, rule breaker. Hmm. Hmm. This is puzzling. Hmm. Mirror magic. Somebody could be doing mirror magic. Definitely doing some type, some type of spell work on you. But I feel like I'm dealing. I'm this reading is for a divine masculine. Hmm. Distractions. Curse your dirty underwear. Hex a I'm trying to tell you, hex a curse. This person is was poisoning your food. 
sister wives met each other. Wait a minute. You could be this queen of wands. Maybe a, a, an ancestor, an emperor ancestor could be giving you information or downloads that's probably teaching you how to, to, to master something with the help from the dark, the lower vibrational. They could be teaching you something or giving you some type of assistance, queen of wands. Something about your house and home partnerships. And it could be this, the male you're messing with, his, the sister wife could be the one that's doing this. Yes, that's ops. Don't trust your inner circle. I'm just trying to look at it both ways because it says Anth ancestors of the dark is helping. I'm telling you, you have ancestral. This person could have, I mean, with this, this curses and hexes and all this, this mere magic, whatever they were doing to you, it could have been, man. It says cold case love, it's over. And with three people being unalived, this person could have unalived other people. And when they came after you, your ancestors from both stepped in. Yes. Because this masculine could have been messing with another woman called Sister Wives. But it could have been a hitman on a bike coming at you. That's why I think your ancestors are stepping in. And it says a motorcycle game. Ops. Ops again, I'm trying to tell you. Yeah. Something about a two of cups situation is the same sex relationship. It could have even been two males. And it says sorry every time. Forgiveness. This could have even been two males. Yeah. Peace of mind, balance. Whoever you are, don't worry. You're definitely gonna get peace of mind. Um it's illegal activities. They get some illegal activity. Like I said, it's three people on a live in an apartment. And it's all an inside job. I hope you can read my book. That failed. It's South Note, Past Life Karmics. I'm telling you. I don't know who. Uh, it's a it, it hit man on a bike. This man could have. Ooh, wee. So could your masculine have been messing with a man? And this man is trying to hurt you? And you may have even met this man. He probably called himself a sister wife. We sent to hurt you. Sent to hurt you. Man. Take off your poker faces at the top. Take off your poker face. And stage a hit on a famous person. Somebody could have staged a hit on a famous person? Yo, this came out in the, I'm oh, sorry. This came, this is similar to the fire reading. It says alive, not dead, fake news. So could a famous person fake their death? It says the devil made me do it. And wake up to your full potential. Doors are open, all blocks are removed. Whoa. I don't know who you are, but it says ops. Don't trust your inner circle. You could even be famous within your city. You could just be famous within your city. You don't have to be famous around the world. But somebody did something illegal and they sent, it seems like a hitman on a bike to hurt you. But whoever your ancestor is, this hermit energy, you're getting some type of quick message or something's coming at you with this emperor like i said this could even be your father that could have could have passed on but some you're getting help from um both sides if you get what i'm saying especially with um being able to control lower vibrational you could be a very very powerful very very powerful um person and you could be feminine energy it says dark male witch warlock. I'm telling you, whoever came met you thought that they could do this. And it could even been your masculine. It says dive deep, awareness, inner voice. I'm telling you, you could have a, an emperor ancestor that is helping you. Somebody did a love spell on you. You could be a feminine energy. 
decision time. Oh, I'm sorry. Earth, your reading is going to be a little bit longer. Loyalty at the bottom. Yeah. It's an inside job. So this could have been your masculine attacking you. And maybe your father or somebody, uh, it could have even been a grandfather. Look, cursed, hex, witchcraft, I'm trying to tell you. They don't brought out the other side. Ooh, we, they, somebody's trying to take you out. Past life, deja vu, repeating patterns, karmic cycle, clinging, holding on, obsessing, uh, spying, bitterness, um, resentment, anger, hurtful words, shallow, ha um, hollow, empty, boredom, time, waiting, cycles, moment. I'm trying to tell you. Uh, evasive, dishonest, deception, trickery. So you could be trying to grow. Or this masculine could be trying to grow. This is nourish, self-growth, self-focus, soul-finding, uh, soul, um, divine masculine, that yang energy, influences, attachments, third party. I feel like this is the fire sign reading together, confession coming in, coming clean. This feminine energy could have been messing with the same sex at her job, messing with a feminine energy. And they could call each other sister wives as well. Take this where it resonates. But somebody sent a hitman to do something to you. And this feminine could have even been poisoning your food, Emperor. Or you could be a feminine energy whose masculine is doing this. You can reverse the roles. But um, your ancestors are trying to give you some type of download or teach you something. So you might want to pay attention. Because whoever came at you has already hurt other people. And that came out in the reading. So um, they were trying to do something to you. But um, they could have even poisoned you. And you could have uh, not have passed. And they thought you did. So, yeah. These readings are tied together today. This earth and fire sign reading. So if you see the earth sign reading first, go and watch the fire sign reading. These are connected. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And when I was doing the fire sign reading, I felt um, Capricorn and Taurus energy. And I said that in the reading. These are tied together. Definitely. Definitely. This person could even distract you with other women. Could have brought other women into this. Because passion, like I said, opens a passion. Distraction. This person could have distracted you with other women. Could have even allowed you to have sister wives. But this person was poisoning you. Ooh, we. This energy is crazy. Curses, hexes. Yeah, and that other one, this, this feminine energy was doing death spells on your children. Hmm. But you're being taught something. It could even be your, your feminine energy, the divine feminine. Because both of these readings came out with divine masculine in both readings. Both of them did. But divine masculine, whoever you are, you should definitely pay attention to your dreams. Because that dream came up in my mind for, some, for a reason. And um, there's some type of balancing that needs to happen with you. Because the fire sign reading was Osiris, um, healing divine masculine came out. So there's some type of healing and some type of information that the ancestors are definitely trying to give you and protection. So, wow. This is my 1010 reading for um, Earth Signs. Um, please like and subscribe the video and definitely protect yourself. Definitely meditate 24, 24 on the clock. Definitely stay prayed up. Your ancestors are, are definitely looking at you. They're, they're trying to, um, they're protecting you. They're trying to give you some, some type of info or something. There. This is my healing goodness. <clears throat> I refine my character and overcome difficulties by remaining positive. I calm my heart and illuminate my, intel my intellect. 
to transform shadow into light. I constantly manifest goodness and goodness in and around me. I improve my qualities for the benefit of all goodness. Keep looking and moving towards that goodness and healing. Because in the other one, it was definitely about healing. Um, healing, especially the abuse that um, this mask suffered as a child through the hands of um, the, it came out of reading their father or even their uncle, but it came out as a father, um, the abuse, and um, which led to um, sexual addictions with multiple sexes and people. So this could be what the ancestors are trying to heal and trying to help um, this divine masculine step into um, their divine energy. So. Um, whoever you are, Divine Masculine, you are a reincarnation of somebody very, very powerful and special that came out in the fire sign reading um, to the point where I'm even nervous to even speak it. That's how powerful this is. So, um, yeah. Please take care. Like and subscribe.